how are you going about driving infrastructure development and attracting other investments into the RBIDZ? I know you've spoken about the importance of ensuring energy um, is available, obviously, for um, industrial purposes. But can you just um, unpack that a bit more for us? We are guided uh, by our, our strategic position. Uh, even in the selection of our priority sectors, we are driven by the competitive advantage that we have in the richest Bay. So with the port, which is a very strategic asset to the richest Bay, we are able to drive a certain investments and very specific investments. If you look at our area, it's, it's, it's quite rich in terms of agriculture, hence, agriculture and the development of AgriHub, which is a project that has been uh, approved by the provincial government to drive um, the beneficiation of our agricultural produce, even for the small scale farmers who are not able to have access to markets. We are able to uh, aggregate all of that produce and take it through the AgriHub for export purposes. And therefore we would have linked the small scale growers with the international markets and uh, something that they wouldn't have been able to, to access. Even the further processing of that agricultural produce is something that uh, <clears throat> uh, can be achieved. In the main, we, 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 we procure land, strategic pieces of land linked to the port, whether it's linked through uh, the pipeline or the linked through roads, but all our estates are linked to the port in terms of the proximity of this estate. We have separated them. You, 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 you look at phase 1F, it's mainly heavy industries, gas projects, uh, titanium dioxide pigment, Prosta paint is a painting, is a paint uh, coating uh, manufacturing plant. Those are heavy industries, but if you look at Phase 1A, uh, you have your Fortune 500 company, Welma, located in, 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 in Phase 1A, and it's an audible oils um, plant. Uh, we have a pipeline link directly from Beth to the tanks um, uh, in Phase. So we, we build infrastructure to ensure that our estates are ready, they are infrastructure ready, they are secure, they are linked to the key infrastructure, they are linked to the port, so that it becomes much easier for our investors to, to trade. And, and in the main, that's what the Richest Bay ITZ is about. It's about providing that necessary infrastructure. But over and above that, you will understand that the, the Special Economic Zone and the Special Economic Zone Act does provide incentives for operating within the special economic zone. And those in incentives are quite important because they, as we give back these incentives, the investors are able to invest more in creating jobs that are much needed. So we create an enabling infrastructure and the estates that will allow our investors to flourish and therefore create jobs that are needed.